What's up guys? Dustin R here. Today's uh, video, I know I just did one. I know, I know. But uh, I'm gonna do another update video because <laughs> I haven't really been posting a lot, right? Uh, and in the last update video, I didn't really explain why necessarily I wasn't posting too much. It's just that I hadn't been. So yeah, I, uh, I have been not home a lot and uh, it's just been keeping me from essentially going to the places that I've been going to and just thinking and making content. Cool, this is some limestone right down here. So today I was just uh, wanted to talk about what's been distracting me and it's nothing serious, nothing too serious except for that snapchat deletion that sucked so that kind of really ticked me off but that's not really why i haven't been on uh, uh. so i've been going to my friend's house either in Kissimmee or daytona or port orange i've been visiting my friends a lot and when i'm doing that i'm not really making videos or you know because i don't really asked my friends if they want to be in videos I just figured that they don't want to be so not really trying to go out and film around them and make them feel uncomfortable so just don't really make content when I'm not at home and uh, I prefer to make content out in the Sun like this you know you've never really seen me make a video in my room necessarily or anything like that so I prefer to be out and about when I'm out here yapping at the camera but uh, so yeah, I've been uh, with my friends and that's just, you know, kept me from editing the content that I do have. I have content that like been editing. I have a whole like, uh, like a mushroom exploration adventure at Seminole Ranch where I'm not, I'm not picking anything or doing anything illegal, you know? I'm just showing everyone the, uh, the mushrooms that I was finding there on a, a great flush this summer. So I haven't edited that. Um, I have a Springs video that I have yet to edit. Uh, I want to figure out how to put some music to that. I just started using music in the last video. Hope you guys will start watching that. Maybe click back on that or something. Uh, if not, it's whatever. Uh, so I just started making, put music in my content, which uh, is going to take a little bit of getting used to. And, uh, well, aside from just, like, getting sidetracked from the editing, uh, I've been really sidetracked with, uh, cryptocurrency. <laughs> it's really engulfed me since July. Like, um, I've been sitting on a decent amount of, uh, capital for a while, and just never occurred to me that I haven't been investing in my life, either with, um, uh, stocks or crypto or, you know, buying, uh, uh, like portions of like homes or whatever you know I haven't done any of that so uh, I was like all right so I started looking into some stocks that I wanted to get and I was looking into the cryptos that I wanted to get too and then crypto started taking off and the hype train of crypto taking off right now so I've been really wrapped up with like watching uh, crypto charts and uh, watching the gains that I'm making and it's it's funny, but um, I'm about ready to put it down and just let it sit for a while because I've about invested everything that I want to invest for the time being. And I'm just going to, like I said, let that sit. Uh, hopefully withdraw some profits from Bitcoin as it continues to go up in price. And, you know, it's going up and then it goes down and it's up and down a little bit up and then it'll go up like this one day. And that's probably when you want to start taking some profits because within a couple hours when bitcoin starts going straight up like that it's usually a, a decent sign that it's probably a correction it's usually usually so advice if you're getting into crypto don't forget to take your profits you know like as you're going up and you're seeing the value of your crypto go up uh maybe sell a portion of what you have to the point where you put back in. So say you like put in $25 of Bitcoin and over like three months that 25 turned into $75. You're like, holy shit. You know, don't just let it sit there, you know. Possibly 
withdraw fifty dollars of that so you have your, your the twenty five dollars value just in case something happens something crashes the market crashes and then what you can do with that fifty dollars is you can buy as the market crashes and you have more buying power um that takes a lot of practice and nerve to get used to doing i'm terrible at doing it what i just do is i dollar cost average in so like uh, i'll set aside like 25 dollars for the day that i want to buy crypto and i look at the price and i'm like okay this is where i'm going to buy today and i buy that price and the next day it's a it's a different price and i look where i'm going to buy for that day and you just average in your cost so uh, if the price just skyrockets one day or plummets one day, you're not necessarily fucked. <laughs> so yeah, I've been really distracted. Um, but I'm going to get back to making the content. Uh, not really out of ideas, I just kind of <laughs> stopped thinking about ideas. Uh, I feel like there's a difference there when you, when you stop trying to come up with creative ideas. And um, when you're actually out of ideas, those are two different things. And I definitely have plenty of ideas that I can be talking to you guys about. It's just, I've been busy. So I'll be getting back to it. It's going to be getting into fall pretty soon here. So the weather patterns are going to start shifting. The rains are going to start being much more infrequent up until October. And then when the rains come in October, what happens is they bring cold air from the north and that uh, starts you know, the different season. <laughs> and the mycology, the mushrooms, they're no longer growing unless they're the, the variety that specializes in the, the winter, really. So not much more opportunity for that to come this way, even though what opportunity I have had uh, has been really really crappy this year central florida where where i'm at did not get the rain as usual compared to like north florida or south florida north florida gets like the jet stream it pushes it it, it uh successfully pushes more moisture up towards north florida if you ask me and then the everglades gets a, a buttload of moisture too but yeah, here in Central Florida, it's like if you're not on the coast, you're not you're not guaranteed to get that rain. That's that's what it is. Anyways, you guys wanna you guys wanna go in the water? You guys wanna go in the water? Yeah, hold on, let me let me pause this. Pretty to me, got my little GoPro feedback. The greens, 
just really amazing here. Too bad I can't. I mean, I could go further in deep. I'd get my shorts wet, but honestly, forgetting about my shorts, there are leeches in here. I'm not. No, sir. No, ma'am. No, sir, and no, ma'ams. <laughs> All right. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this little update blab about crypto, essentially. Um, yeah. I'll uh, be making more content again. Don't worry. Don't worry for the handful of you that are supporting me with the views. I appreciate it. Um, if you guys have any tips on how I could uh, increase my subscribership, please, I am all ears. <laughs> I'm still very new at this. Since Snapchat was deleted, uh, it's harder for me to reach out to social media. I don't use Facebook. I mean, I'm pretty sure I could. But I'm not necessarily sure everyone that follows me on Facebook is trying to find, you know, abstract content like this. That's a nice way to put it. Uh, so, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, if you have any ideas, uh, hit me up. If you have been helping promote my channel to your friends, I really appreciate that. If you have any products you want me to promote, you know, uh, uh, I will promote them. I have a homie, and he's got a clothing setup, and... Uh, once I have permission, I'll, I'll, I'll promote that homie uh, once I pick up some of that clothing. He's got a really cool logo or a slogan, so I don't know. If you're a local here, you need some sweaters, you know, hit me up. 